For this problem, we want to use transformations and the graph of f of x equals the log base 3 of x to graph g of x equals the log base 3 of negative x plus 4. g of x equals f of negative x plus 4. The negative x means that we reflect the graph over the y-axis. So our new points are at negative 1, 0 and negative 3, 1. Connecting the points, we get the graph of f of negative x. Adding 4 to the function means that we shift the new graph up by 4 units. So our new points are at negative 1, 4 and negative 3, 5. Connecting the points, we get the graph of g of x. This is the final answer.